Hi, this is Joe Herman. If you've watched any of my videos before on this channel, you'll know that I'm all about visual arts, uh, digital filmmaking, 3D animation, 3D modeling, visual effects, digital painting, digital sculpting, uh, audio recording, creative work. And therefore, when I make videos about computers, I focus on high-end workstations because those are the kind of machines you need to do this kind of work. Recently in New York I had the uh, opportunity to meet with HP to take a look at a machine that's really kind of squarely aimed at creative artists and uh, people that do this kind of work. It's a very exciting machine. It's called the HP ZBook X2 and it's kind of a unique new machine which I'm really excited about. I think that if you're into creative work, if you're doing uh, photography or uh, filmmaking or di especially digital painting, digital sculpting, 3D animation, uh, you'll really be interested in this machine. What's really interesting about this machine is that it's a detachable workstation which means you can detach the keyboard from the screen and then the machine kind of functions kind of like a graphics tablet, a little bit like a Wacom Cintiq, uh, but um, uh, HP's version of it, but it's with a really high powered workstation uh, class performance in it. And um, some of the amazing things about this machine, for example, is that the screen itself is a 4K dream color 10-bit display. So it's color calibrated to cover 100% of Adobe RGB. And if you know about dream color, you know that these are very quality, high-end displays. It comes with a pen to draw, in, to draw with and to paint with. And this pen recognizes tilt. It's got 4,096 uh, levels of sensitivity. And basically the pen was designed by HP themselves with uh, technology in it from Wacom. Uh, so it's, it's really a, a sensitive artist's machine. If you're a creative professional, I think you'll really be interested in this machine, the ZBook X2 detachable workstation. So we're here with Mario Campos. So give us a little introduction to this machine and what makes it so great and what's it all about. Yeah, so exactly like you said, this will be the world's first detachable workstation. It's actually the world's most powerful uh, detachable PC. Um, after talking to a lot of creatives, a lot of product designers, a lot of industrial designers, two big pain points that they've shared with us is that they're not getting enough performance capabilities from their inking devices that they use today. It could be a tablet like an iPad Pro or a Surface Pro. They're not getting enough performance to run their professional applications. Also, they're using multiple devices to get their work done. So they're, those are the two big pain points that they're dealing with today. And so with this detachable workstation, we're aiming to deliver an experience that is aimed at making them better at what they do, getting their work done faster than before, and eliminating the multi-device multi complexity that they're dealing with on a day-to-day -day basis. So the fact that the pen, which was designed by HP, has 4,096 levels of pressure, yes. right? It has no battery. The screen is a 10-bit dream color display at 4K resolution. This machine is great for anyone who's doing high-end illustrations or artwork or sculpting or animation. Absolutely, yep. So you very scalable performance. So you have NVIDIA Quadro graphics. So you can start with 2D sketching, import your work into a 3D application. As I mentioned earlier, not having to deal with two different devices, one for sketching and then one for uh, heavier editing and 3D modeling. Uh, you can do this all in one device, very scalable performance. And with NVIDIA Quadro, it's supporting all of the major workstation applications. And it also has two Thunderbolt 3 ports on it, so you can hook in you know, hard drive arrays, external GPU, accelerators, uh, dream color displays. It's a very, very scalable 
uh, connectivity as well. Exactly like you say, with dual Thunderbolt 3 ports, you're able to connect external storage arrays. So if you're a photographer or if you're a video editor, you can do video playback and transfer 4K files seamlessly with the uh, 40 gigabits uh, throughput on the Thunderbolt 3 ports. Um, additionally, exactly, you can connect the Thunderbolt docking solution and connect up to five displays. Five displays? Up to five displays on the HP wow. ZeeBook X2. That's incredible. Yes. So tell us about the, the, uh, the, the keyboard. This is a really nice looking keyboard. So can you give us more information about it? Yeah, absolutely. And it's actually a very familiar keyboard if you look closely enough. This is actually the same keyboard that we're using on our HP ZBook Studio uh, Gen 4. So we're putting in a 15 inch uh, mobile workstation keyboard into our 14 inch detachable. And so uh, the other experience that we wanted to deliver from a detachable uh, perspective is that when you detach we don't want you to believe that you're using a tablet. You can have full access to your keyboard because it's connected via Bluetooth. So now if you're using a pro application like Premiere Pro or doing uh, uh, work in SolidWorks or uh, Auto, Autodesk Sketchbook Pro, all of those shortcuts that you live and breathe every day are completely at the tip of your fingers with the keyboard right next to you. So the keyboard doesn't have to be attached for it to work. Exactly. So Fully you can have this thing on your lap and, you know, working on your lap and once in a while reach over to the keyboard and use it if you want to work it, it, That's correct. That's correct. And let's just say that um, you want to just escape the desk side domain and just go go to your own uh, creative zone. It could be outside uh, at the park. Um, you can leave the keyboard at home and uh, take the device in tablet mode and all of your shortcuts are still accessible with the HP Quick Keys. So these are user customizable. So all of the shortcuts that you use in your workstation applications, you can uh, manage those within the HP Quick Keys with up to 18 different shortcuts. Awesome. And let's go just one more time, go over the um, storage and memory on the machine. Yes, yeah, so this has up to 32 gigs of memory, dual channel, so you're gonna get max bandwidth with your quad-core CPUs. Um, additionally, up to two terabytes of storage. So we're doubling up the competition with memory with 32 gigs, more than any other detachable in the industry, and also um, more than, uh, with two terabytes of storage, more than any other detachable in the industry as well. NVMe, PCIe. NVMe, PCIe, exactly. NVMe, Z Turbo Drive uh, storage performance. And once again, can we just take a look at the back of the machine? Yes, so the stand is fully integrated. So unlike other devices where other inking devices that sell their stand separately, we've designed it into the device. Um, and so when you're not using the stand, it just uh, fades into the background because it's designed flush to the industrial design. Uh, and these are the vents and everything. Yeah, so this is, yeah, exactly. So this, um, this design here is not for show. This is actually intentionally designed this way. So this is... HP active cooling so you have cool air coming in from the sides from both the left and right side which offsets the heat that's inside the device and with we have two custom-made uh, fans that keep the device cool and so uh, the cool air comes in through the device and then goes out through the top so if you're and using it thing, go ahead, if, yep. go ahead and once you're using it uh, as a tablet or if you're sketching on it, uh, the heat is actually away from you because all of the components are designed behind the top cover with the fans. So all of the heat's on this side and away from the user when they're sketching. And just could you turn it over one more time? Yes. So what's this, a camera? You've got a front-facing and back-facing camera? Yes, yeah, so we have world-facing, so you can do a quick capture of your, if, let's just say if you want to do uh, 2D sketching on paper, you can quickly... Uh, to do that capture, bring it into the device, and bring it into the application that you're working with. That's awesome. And just once again, on the ports here, you've got two Thunderbolt 3 HDMI? Yes, uh, two Thunderbolt 3 ports. Uh, we have uh, the power adapter. Uh, the Thunderbolt 3 ports support charge in as well, uh, full bandwidth um, bidirectionally. Um, we have HDMI 1.4. We have USB 3.0 port which is charging as well. Um, and then we have a SD card reader. So for our 
our users that um, use that uh, SD card slot for Great photography. For photography. Yeah. for photography, the SD card reader is a nice delighter for them. Uh, and then a fingerprint uh, reader uh, for just an added security authentication method. And quickly on the other side? And then on the other side, we have a headphone jack. Uh, we have the power button. We have the uh, volume controls. And then a security lock slot as well. I see. Well, this machine really looks like a great machine for any kind of artist or animator or anyone who's involved in creative stuff. It's kind of like a little bit of a Wacom Cintiq with a powerful computer in it, a 4K 10-bit color display on it. So that's over a billion colors. Right? Yeah, that's correct. With 100% of Adobe RGB. 100% of Adobe RGB. And we'll have, the, we'll have two options of the display. So we'll have a 4K... Uh, display and in a 4K dream color. So let's just say if you work just with black and white sketching and you want to bring it into you know pro apps like Autodesk or SolidWorks and you may not need the dream color option so we have the, the 4K uh, display option available to you as well. And all of them come with touch, right? All of them are touch, that's correct. So it's touch plus, plus 8K. That is correct. Yes. Well, thank you very much. Uh, this is a very exciting machine. Uh, I think this machine will be great for any kind of people involved in creative arts. Once again, this is Joe Herman. Thanks, and see you next time. <laughs>